So in this video, let us look into the construction of a histogram when midpoints of class intervals are given. Well, this type of a construction of a histogram is very simple. Of course, the basic steps are there. That is, draw two mutually perpendicular lines. One is OX and one is OY. That is, the x-axis and y-axis. And all those things are same. But leaving all, all those things, let us get into the actual steps that we have to do to construct a histogram when midpoints of class intervals are given. So the first step is here. Find the difference between second and first midpoint and let it be H. The second step, divide the difference H by 2. The third step is here. Subtract H by 2 from first midpoint to get the lower limit of the first class and add H by 2 to the first midpoint to get the upper limit of the first class. The fourth and the final step is repeat the first three steps for all the other midpoints. Now after ascertaining the lower and the upper class limits of different classes from the given midpoints, we construct the histogram by the procedure explained earlier. So the forthcoming videos will illustrate the above procedure here.